how to factory reset a Dell laptop or desktop PC without the password. In this video, I'm going to show you how to perform a full factory reset of a Dell computer without having to log into it or use your password, anything like that. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribe to my channel because that really helps me out. So this is actually really easy to do. The first thing we need to do is get to where the laptop is asking us for the password, then hold down the shift key on the keyboard and go down to the power icon in the bottom right of the screen, select it, and then select restart. Keep holding the shift key. And then what you want to do is select restart anyway, if it says that. Once it starts rebooting, keep holding the shift key until you see the screen turn blue and you have a new menu. Once you get to this screen, you can go ahead and let go of the shift key. And then once on the screen, just select troubleshoot. From there, select reset this PC. And then you can choose two different options. Keep my files. This removes the apps and the settings, but keeps your personal files. But if you don't know the password, this will probably not work for you. So what we need to do is select remove everything. And this removes all the files and apps and settings. So select that. After that, it's going to give you two different options, cloud download or local reinstall. Cloud download will work fine. It'll give you the latest version of Windows when it reinstalls it. So you won't have to update. But if you think the laptop might have any storage issues where it has low storage, or maybe you have slow internet or no internet at all. And I know this laptop does not have very much storage. So I'm just going to do local reinstall. So select your option. It'll go ahead and get the PC ready for a factory reset. If the laptop or PC has multiple drives in it, this one has two. You can factory reset all of them, wipe everything from all of them if you want to. I'm only going to do the drive where Windows is installed because I have some files backed up on the other drive. So I'll select that. And then right here, this is an important option. You can just have the files removed from the laptop or you can fully clean the laptop. And this is what you want to do if you're going to be selling the laptop, giving it to someone, or maybe doing anything where you're not going to have possession of the laptop anymore, do a fully clean of the drive. It will take a little bit longer, but this will help ensure that all of your data is safe. So I'm just going to do just remove my files, but if you're getting rid of it, I recommend doing fully clean the drive. So I'll select just remove my files. It's going to load. And then now we just need to go through and we can confirm everything, read through this, make sure you're okay with it and then select reset. And now it's going to perform a factory reset of this laptop. So just give it some time. During this time, I do recommend having, if it's a laptop, have it plugged in just so the battery doesn't die while you're going through this process. Once it's done resetting, it'll then start installing Windows. And then after that, you'll need to select your region and go through some basic setup, just like you would if you got the laptop new. So you'll be setting it up completely, adding a user to it, getting it connected to the internet, everything like that. But now you have successfully reset this PC or laptop without the password. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel.